I wanted to read to you 1 Corinthians 10, 13. This is the first verse that I pulled out of the scripture bow at the YMCA. No temptation has seized you except what is common to man. And God is faithful. He will not let you be tempted beyond what you can bear. But when you are tempted, he will also provide a way out so that you can stand up under it. And, you know... Um, there's a lot of temptation in the YMCA, believe it or not. And when it comes to a man's point of view, um, there's a lot of women that wear tight yoga pants and stuff like that. And they don't dress properly. The women don't. Well, it's the same thing for the women. The women are also tempted too because there's some dude that's not dressed properly. In. And I'm not going to take my shirt off the YMCA because I wear a t-shirt when I go swimming. And But some guys, they do wear nothing. You know, and I'm talking about nothing because there are some guys that come in there that just wear Speedos and that's it. And these are older guys, too. These ain't the young guys. These are the older men that are in, you know, 50, uh, 50, 60 years old. They might not be a Christian, but they still have, uh, they still can use their common sense that, you know, kids being around and stuff like that. But they don't. They don't care. And, but anyways, you know, we're, when we're in, in a situation that we're tempted, don't look. When we're in a situa situation that we're tempted, don't do it. When we're in a situation and we're tempted, turn away. And so, um, you know, there's a song that I was listening to. Let me see if I can get it up here. Here we go. It's like everywhere I go, and everything I do, people look at me, I pray that they see you. It's like everywhere I go, and everything I do, people look at me, I pray that they see you. You see, that song says, you know, I want other people to see me and when they see me they see Christ in me and if we're tempted by these things and we're tempted at the gym and you know we're going to be tempted regardless whether man or woman and but if we fall for it and people say man look at that guy that guy just looked at check that girl out look at that woman she's supposed to be married and she just checked that guy out you know and they ain't going to see Christ in us and that's a guaranteed but if we follow Christ and we follow his word and like this um, verse says, when we are tempted, you know, God will make a way for us to get out and get away from it. And, you know, I stood forever in the foyer earlier at the YMCA because it wasn't because it was tempted or anything like that. But I was waiting for somebody to get off a machine there. But they kept going back to it and stuff. They're a little bit more, go back to it. They're a little bit more, go back to it. And so I didn't worry about it. So I went into the the exercise room that me and Austin usually go in. And I just use one of those machines in there because they do have one in there that I can do arm weights and pull down and stuff. And, and I wanted to do that. I wanted to get my arm, you know, stronger, my left arm and stuff stronger because I'm under... A doctor's care where I'm not able to lift over 10 pounds and so I'm able to you know strengthen my arm with 10 pounds and so I wanted to do that and so I went ahead and went to the gym and done that but there was a lot of people in there like there was a few girls and stuff and I'm glad that they were pretty much dressed properly because there's a lot of people that do come up there that are not dressed properly you know they show everything and they don't care and I don't know why girls and grown women and uh, young guys and older guys do that um, are you trying to attract somebody because you're doing it in a, for the wrong reasons going to YMCA is there to be you know work out and lose weight and stay fit it's not a pick up girls it's not a place to pick up guys and so it's time that we you know, if you're a Christian, it's time that you dress properly. Even if you aren't a Christian, use common sense and dress properly. If you're married, 
dress properly. If you're engaged, dress properly. I'm pretty sure that your husband or your wife doesn't want you going up to a YMCA looking all like a hoochie and looking like all like a gigolo or something and, and attracting young men and attracting young girls. And so it's time that we stand against this and, you know, not try to be tempted. And if we are tempted, walk away. Get out. And that's what the word of God says. He will make a way for you to get out. Take care and have a great day.